All right, now do a roll. Damn, that makes you drunk. Huh? That makes you drunk. That's a good roll there. are supposed to be on the downside. Huh? Where it plugs in the stabilizer. The wire end was supposed to be down. That work over rig is getting a lot of pictures. Huh? That work over rig is getting a lot of pictures. Of the arms. What hold you got him in? Let me get back out. <laughs> got a good launch that time. I was close to it also. I wasn't so far back away. Hovering part of the
first time I did that. Yeah, get me dizzy. I guess Nick wasn't really impressed. He's leaving already. Huh? Nicky's I guess so. I know it. No, that thing is heavy. That big motor and everything. Do something, I'll fix my shoulder. Yeah. This is a Firefly Times 2 uh, built by Bobby Mundy and Wayne Morris. What we wanted to do is build something with vertical takeoff, so we took two. Firefly kits from Fancy Foam and sliced it all up, put it together. We put a piece of carbon fiber square tubing in the center to give it some rigidity. Had to experiment some on the motors, but we wound up with a 315 watt motor. Gives it plenty of power. We've also got it set up so that there's a top and bottom rudder. You can see here the top rudder and the bottom rudder. And uh, also we've got a program mix so that all four of the surfaces will work as aileron. Um, added some carbon fiber supports. You can see towards the top. And right now it also has a three axis stabilizer that we're still experimenting with. The prop that's on here is a 10 by 3.8. Servos are uh, Hobby King 900s. And we've been flying this with 1,500 to 1,600 uh, milliamp hour 3S batteries, uh, 30 amp ESC on it. Preliminary flight tests look pretty good. We're able to do vertical takeoffs. We may have to practice a little bit to get the landings, to try to have vertical landings. This is the motor. It's a Turnigy AeroDrive. And as I said before, the maximum power on this is 315 watts. Pulling about 30 amps on the 3S battery right now. I've got it all powered up now. We'll take a look at the rudders. They're dragging on the grass a little bit. All right. We'll take a look at the elevators. Now we'll take a look at the elevators. Ailerons. You can see all all four ailerons are working. We also have this hooked up on a switch that can be turned off 